Innovation is about constantly reimagining what's possible across borders, sectors and systems. From the days of barter to the rise of global trade routes, humanity has always found new ways to connect and exchange value. The financial ecosystem is rapidly evolving. Advances in digital technology and open finance are expanding access to essential financial services, empowering individuals and businesses, fueling economies and supporting livelihoods. But small and medium enterprises still struggle to access funding and new markets. Meet Wandi Lezondo, co-founder of Thesis Lifestyle, a streetwear brand from Soweto founded 20 years ago. He is now trying to expand beyond South African borders. Like many small businesses, Wandile is burdened by unreliable data, outdated systems that rely on paper trails and intermediaries. These are the barriers keeping opportunity out of reach. I think the cost of the red tape, honestly, is just in both ways, money and time. You know, uh, I mean, for us... SME, I've realized that, especially in the clothing industry, you have to work six months ahead. So the cash flow, I see, it plays a huge impact. The world needs agile systems that enhance access to safe and open finance, easing cross-border trade. Under South Africa's G20 presidency, the South African Reserve Bank, in partnership with the Bank for International Settlements, invites the world's brightest minds to develop bold and scalable solutions that promote trust and integrity in finance. This year's Tech Sprint challenges innovators to build real-world solutions in three key areas. Digital identity, credit data portability, fraud and cyber risk. These solutions will lay the groundwork for financial services that are more inclusive, secure and interoperable. I'm not an IT person, I'm not a policy maker, you know, I'm an entrepreneur. I want to trade, but I know the answers lies with automation, it lies with policy making it easy with just a click of a button, money is transferred from South Africa to Uganda or Nigeria. A robust open finance ecosystem will unlock opportunities for entrepreneurs like Wandile and millions of others, allowing them to trade, grow and thrive. Submissions close on 20 June 2025. Shortlisted entries will each receive a 5,000 US dollar stipend and the winning solution will receive 30,000 US dollars. Winners will be announced in November in South Africa.